First of all you have to enter your username. Then you have to enter your password. Then you have to log in. Now you have to go to software configuration. Click on software setup. Enter your company name. Enter your mobile number. Enter software base URL. Enter company website. Enter your mail ID. Scroll down. Enter software price. Enter Facebook link. Enter LinkedIn link. Enter Instagram link. Enter YouTube link. Enter Android application link. Enter iOS application link. Enter your company light logo. Enter your company dark logo. Enter your company favicon. Click on update details. Click on configuration setup. Insert Google Map API. Insert Firebase Server API. For find your Firebase Server API. First you have to open Google Chrome. Type Google Firebase. And follow the screen. Go to console. Go to add project. Enter the name of your project. And come from it. Press continue. Press create project. Press continue. Go into the setting of project overview. Open project setting. Click on cloud messaging. Click on this icon. Enable the cloud messaging. Go on the page of Firebase. Click on generate the key pair. Copy the key. Copy the code. And search remote desktop connection. And follow the screen. Enter yes. Follow the screen. Search Sublime Text. Drop those two files in Sublime Text. Paste the code. Minimize the Sublime Text and go to Firebase. Go to Project Overview. Go to Web Icon. Enter your app nickname. Enter Register App. Follow the screen. Copy the code. Press Continue to console. Go to Sublime Text. Follow the screen. Paste the code. Close all the panel of Sublime Text. Close Fleet Stack Software. Go to Project Overview Enter in Setting. Go to Project Setting. Go to Cloud Messaging. Copy the Server Key. Paste the Server Key in Firebase Server API Key. Press Update Key Setting. Go to Email SMTP Setup. 
Choose TLS in encryption type. Follow the screen. Press update SMTP credentials. Scroll up the page. Click on web URL, go to hosting and DNS. This section might be named DNS management, DNS settings, DNS records or something similar. Create new DNS a record. Enter domain name. Enter IP address. Press update. Enter URL. Now your software logo and other components has been changed. Now log into Super Admin. Open IIS Manager. Click on Sites. Click on Web. Click on Bindings. Add URL name at host name. Click OK. Click Close. Close the IIS panel. Download Win Acme. Press Download. Click on the downloaded folder. Click on folder path type CMD to open command prompt. Follow the screen.
Open IIS again. Go to basic setting. Set physical path. Enter program files x86. Enter web. Press OK. Press OK. Press restart. Close IIS panel. Your web portal is now secured with SSL.